Hello ladies and gentlemen, this is your one and only little psych from Adam Antipas Entertainment, aka Hannibal Snyder from EUW and IPCW, and well today, we got another take test video for you, something I never tried before, it's not that new, it's newer to me, I've only seen it for a couple months, but today I'm actually trying it because at work, they had them on a sale, buy one and get one, so I got my favorite M&Ms, and then I got, this is not a sponsored video by the way, and then I got these coffee nut M&M's. Okay, I like coffee. I like M&M's. So, hey, why don't I give this a try? So, that's what I figured I would do. You see? I just ate something greasy, so I gotta, hopefully, as you see, I just opened it right here in front of you. Now, I gotta, Just open the bag for you, ladies and gentlemen. Let's see. Come on, let's see, ladies and gentlemen. That's what they look like in the bag. So now, ladies and gentlemen, get the camera set back up right. There we go. I'm going to try one today. Never tried these before. Never had them. But always wanting to have them. They have a long shelf life. They last about a year. Just try them. Mm-hmm. Mm okay. I don't remember which one I just had. Got one each flavor in my hand. Did they taste different? Okay. <clears throat> Not bad at all, actually. Mm, my personal opinion is that it needs to taste more like coffee. It's my opinion. It's a peanut M&M &M with like a coffee flavor to it. So if you like peanut m and and you like coffee, you probably would like this. Would I suggest it to y'all? Of course I suggest it to y'all. My ratings of it would be a 3 out of 5 because it just doesn't have enough coffee flavor to it, in my opinion. So the rating on it would be a 3 out of 5. Other than that, if you like peanut M&M's, which peanut M&M's are one of my favorite M&M's, then yeah, you will enjoy it. Because that's pretty much what you're eating is a peanut M&M with a little bit of a coffee flavor to it. So if you like coffee, peanut M&M's, and you like M&M's, this is definitely a deal for you. Now, the nutrient fats are the total fat are 12 grams. Saturated fat is 23%, aka 4.5 grams. Trans fat, zero. Cosserol will be 5 milligrams. Sodium, 25 milligrams. Carbohydrates, 25. The fiber, Two sugars, twenty-two protein, four grams, and a serving size of one point five ounces, which is about one fourth of a cup. And there's about six serving sizes in this thick bag here. And what's great about this bag right here is it's resealable. So you know, if I don't want to eat them all right now. What's I'm not eating them all right now. Clearly, you can seal them. And put them away for later. So ladies and gentlemen, that's going to conclude this taste test. But something to look get looking forward to is, as you see, it definitely does say new. And it is, as you see, it's chocolate chip muffin in a cup. Yes, actually, ladies and gentlemen, it's perfect size for one. It's about four individual pack 
Kijings in one. So yeah, I'm gonna give this a try. This isn't the only one I got. It's new. I want to see how great this is. How much of a chocolate chip muffin tastes like? If actually it's a good chocolate chip muffin. If it's not, there are no artificial preservatives, flavoring. There's about 18 grams of well, 18 grams of whole grain per serving. So that's kind of pretty cool. Um, and uh, it takes. It's about pretty much all you need is a mug, the pouch, and three tablespoons of water. That's all you need for this. So. That's why I want to see how good it is. You pretty much, you empty the pouch into a microwavable safe cup. You add ta three tablespoons. You stir for about 30 seconds or until the batter is smooth. Then you put this in your microwave for a minute and 10 seconds. Then you let it cool for two minutes. And then you let it, well, you eat it, technically. So, yeah. This isn't that bad. So, I'll do more on this about, uh, I'll do more about this one. And I also got a brownie one. that I'll make the brownie one with some ice cream cream so yeah i'll do more about that another time but right now ladies and gentlemen thompson peace out